Welcome to the practice of the daily office. In this season of disruption, we invite you to join us in a rhythm of prayer. How might our days be grounded more deeply in God's presence if we pause each morning, midday, and evening for silence, scripture, and prayer? Let's begin in silence. Take a deep breath. Remember right now you are in God's loving presence. However you're beginning this day, whatever emotions you're feeling, the Lord is with you. Psalm 139 says there is nowhere we can go to escape God's loving presence. Take another deep breath. God is closer than the air we breathe. These next two minutes of silence are yours to rest in the loving presence of the Lord. I invite you to listen with me to this word of God from the book of Lamentations. Because of the Lord's great love, we are not consumed, for his compassions never fail. They are new every morning. Great is your faithfulness. I say to myself, the Lord is my portion, therefore I will wait for him. The Lord is good to those whose hope is in him, to the one who seeks him. It is good to wait quietly for the salvation of the Lord. Listen to this passage again. Is there a word or a phrase that stands out? Is the Holy Spirit drawing to your attention any particular part of this passage? Because of the Lord's great love, we are not consumed, for his compassions never fail. They are new every morning. Great is your faithfulness. I say to myself, the Lord is my portion, therefore I will wait for him. The Lord is good to those whose hope is in him, to the one who seeks him. It is good to wait quietly for the salvation of the Lord.
Consider what God has for you in this passage. Listen to the Lord. What is God saying to you in this passage today? Take a moment now and respond to God in prayer. Because of the Lord's great love, we are not consumed, for his compassions never fail. They are new every morning. Great is your faithfulness. I say to myself, the Lord is my portion, therefore I will wait for him. The Lord is good to those whose hope is in him, to the one who seeks him. It is good to wait quietly for the salvation of the Lord. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Amen.